welcome back to my channel it's your girl coco styles and in today's video we're going to be talking about how to style a basic white button-up top five ways i believe it's five i may mix and match some stuff but let's start with the first outfit i just have on a basic white button-up top and i believe this shirt is from h&m i do and the reason why i like this shirt it is kind of wrinkled guys because it's not your average material um it almost feels like a light version of a soft denim maybe but this is the first outfit i just have on a basic white top and some striped earrings and um i have it tied up in the front with some leather leggings and these are kind of like rocker ish leggings and just some red booties. Um, I believe these are from BCBG. And guys, you know I'm six feet tall. And these come all the way down to my ankle, past my ankle. No high waters, so we're good. So if you do want some leggings, I would recommend trying there to see what they have because they do carry stuff that are pretty long. Not necessarily a long section, but they do fit me pretty good so this is the first outfit um like i said the shirt is from h&m i believe i'm gonna double check and i just have it tied up in the front and this is simple just going out probably to the not even to the mall like to grab brunch or something on a nice day um and there's some cute red booties simple booties with a little bit of detailing i like this because there's some detailing on the side with some zippers and I think it kind of goes with the aesthetics of the, the pants. So this is the first outfit. And let me get, let me know what you guys think. Is this something that you would wear or no? Um, again, my style is very, it's a mix of some day chic, some day classy. I'm just all around. Um, you won't really catch me in like grunge or... I don't even want to say preppy because I've seen cute things lately that I would probably put together and just kind of throw on. Um, feminine is one thing that I hear being thrown around a lot. I don't necessarily think that being a feminine woman dress wise is always wearing pink. I think you just need to look put together and accessorize, always have your hair and your nails done and you're good to go and smell good guys. <laughs> so this is the first outfit. So let me know what you guys think and I'll be back with the second one with the same top but a different bottom. Welcome back guys. Okay, so this is outfit number two. Like I said, same top. I actually left these earrings on. Um, you could actually wear maybe some silver earrings. I think silver goes really good with black and white. Um, so I have just a full leather skirt and some pumps and the white top. Now, this particular skirt is kind of long. I hope you guys can see it. It's kind of long, but you can actually put some boots on, like some slouch boots. And I have a bang right now, but normally what I would do is, if I were not wearing pumps, I would wear like some slouch boots and I would wear something like this. This hat, um, not necessarily these earrings because they're a little bit busy for the hat. For the hat, but something like this, I would definitely throw on and just be out. It's like a little, little rocker chicish kind of. <laughs> um, and this is what I would do. So this is outfit number two. This hat, I actually sell it on my online boutique. If you guys are interested, I'll actually link that below. Um, we don't have a lot left, but it is still available. Um, the skirt, Zara. Yes, the skirt is from Zara. And my pumps, for those of you guys who have the size 11 foot, these are just some plain old Sam Edelman's. And I think they're a decent height and they're really comfortable. They're not that expensive. And I think they're pretty decent quality. Um, 
So that's it. This is outfit number two with the same white top. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section. Would you guys wear it? And again, I wouldn't necessarily wear this with a bang, of course. Um, but this is what it is. So this is the outfit number two. Let me know what you guys think. And I will get back to you with the third outfit with the same top. All right, guys. Welcome back, guys. Okay, so this is outfit number four, I believe. Three. <laughs> I'll put number three, I think. Three or four. I'll, I'll put the numbers down there. But <clears throat> again, same top. I just threw on some light colored denim jeans and just another pair of pumps. Again, these are Sam Edelman also. Um, these are not expensive. I think they're like $200, I believe. But they're actually very, very comfortable. And like I said, I have big feet, so I gotta get in where I fit in. So this is how I would wear this. And my jeans are actually Levi. I hope you guys can see, but I do not have a problem with finding jeans um, because I'm pretty much accustomed to buying the same jeans. I think I mentioned it in the last video, I used to buy jeans from a company called PZI, but they closed. Um, so I just started searching and then came across these and I believe American Eagle has long also. So this, to add to this outfit, I would just throw on this hat. Um, again, not necessarily with this bang. Um, my hair just so happened to be like this now. Um, I would do something like this and keep it simple. Um, I would probably wear a nice belt, depending on the pants. But you could always pull this out. You could always wear one side in, one side out. It all depends on what your style is. But this is another way you can do it. You can wear it like this and be done. Okay? So again, some simple pumps. A cute hat. This is not necessarily a fedora, but it's just a big floppy hat. So something like this would be cool too. And simple and chic. Okay. So this is another way you can style a basic white shirt. So I'll be back with the next outfit, guys. And actually, no, I actually don't have to be back. <laughs> what I can do is I can take this hat off and I am going to take the shirt and tuck it in. Tuck it in. Okay, make sure it's fitting properly. And you can actually throw on a blazer. This is like, this blazer is gorgeous. This is actually from Blank NYC. When I tell you this feels like butter to me, even though I'm a vegan, I don't eat butter, but you guys get my drift. <laughs> but I would throw it on something like this too. Um, okay, you can fix that up. If you want it to just be, you know, simple. Um, something like this. You could actually change your shoes, you can wear you can leave the nude ones on if you want it. You can change them to black um, to, you know, tone it down a little bit. But you can definitely wear this top with this jacket and these jeans and whatever color shoe you prefer. So this is another way to style this top. 
I would recommend rolling the sleeves down because it feels a little tight right now because I have it rolled up. But roll the sleeves down and you're good to go. So this is this outfit. Let me know what you guys think. And I will be back with the last outfit, which I believe is number five. Maybe number five. <laughs> so I'll see you guys in a second. Welcome back, guys. Okay, so this is outfit number five. Again, same white top, same actual blue denim jeans. I actually threw on another jacket, which is, I believe this is Kenneth Co. Hmm, I'll double check. Um, I'm going to try to link something similar to each of these below. Um, but again, the focus of this video is the white top. So I just have on some more pumps, <laughs> some more pumps. These are like a metallic pink type pump. So this is for one of my playful days. If I feel like being very, I guess, feminine, because they say pink is for femininity. Um, same jeans, but this is it guys. This is how I would style a basic white top. Um, if you guys like this video, please hit that like button. If you like videos like this and you would like to see more, please hit that subscribe button and comment below what else you would like for me to do. Um, I do really enjoy these fashion hauls and stuff like that because it's just something that I love. I love this since I was a child. Get creative and express yourself. So again, guys, thank you for tuning into this video. If you stay to the end of this video, please comment below. Coco, we see you and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.